In this scenario, I will show you how you can instantly trigger a call to your customer after you filled out a contact form, for example, on your website. So let's get to it. Let's say a customer filled out this form here with some random data. You can, well, I did not fill my complete email in here. And he will get now a phone call. It will just take a second and you will get a phone call. So let's take the phone call. Hello, this is Mark from Menu. Hey, nice to meet you, Mark. How are you doing today? I'm doing fantastic, thanks. And I hope you're ready to take your business to the next level because I've got some groundbreaking solutions that could do just that. But first, may I get your name? Yeah, Let's sure. I'm Sebastian. And hey, man, this sounds amazing. Let's book a call for Friday this week. Absolutely, Sebastian. Friday is going to be a game changer for your business. But before we lock it in, what's your email address? My email sure address is... Got it. Let me set up a calendar invite for our call this Friday. Just Amazing. Normal. Just a sec. I've sent that invite your way, Sebastian. You're officially on your path to supercharging your business with Make. Cool. Get Thank you. Hey. And that's it. So you saw I filled out this simple web form and I got a call. So how did I do it? Of course, you can do more business logic here. What I did is I fill out Tally and I create an outbound phone call. And you can do this, for example, with VAPI. It's a really straightforward voice AI agent. And you have here your system. I, as you saw, did not save the scenario module because I have my private phone number in there. And you can use your phone number ID. If you want to have this advanced and want to add more parameters to it, or if you want to customize this even further, I really recommend you looking into the VAPI API documentation because there are thousands of parameters you can send along that you can customize your model, your agent that's calling the customer basically uniquely. So you can have custom voice, you can adjust and update the prompt, you can choose different models, you can have function calling based on customer context. So hear me out, you can do basically everything the API in VAPI. And I think the most important part here I want to show you in this video is that you can actually add tools to it. So if you are not adding, for example, the current day tool to it, if you tell, hey, can you book me a call for Friday this week? It will basically book a call for the 29th of October, 2023. Because that's the day where the model got tra trained if you're using OpenAI. So, in case you want to do this, I would recommend you using, for example, this prompt tool use, use current day tool to identify what's the current day. And that's pretty straightforward. Then you're going to build your tool with the current day. You're going to describe it. You have some JSON you send along. You find all of this in the API docs of Bobby. And then you can go to make and in make, you have a pretty straightforward scenario where you fire the web hook, you copy the web hook, you go to VAPI, you create a new tool, you choose this, you choose that, and you basically are able to save it directly. Cool. And now you have set up a new tool where you can say the property name, for example, is tool today or so on. You can even add more parameters to it, depending on what you need for your tool, right? So you go forward and the tool is today, for example, and this description you can skip in this comment part and ta -dum, you have your tool of today and you can reference to the tool of today in your assistant. So how does tool today look like? You can basically do following. You fire it against the webhook, you set a variable, you need to format it in a special date for VAPI, and then you simply send it back in this webhook response. This is basically how you configure tools for your AI agents inside VAPI with Make. Because Make is an amazing tool provider. You could use this for contacting your CRM to cross-check if you already know this customer or if you know a similar customer and you want to tweak the messaging of the assistant. So possibilities with these tools are basically endless, right? So let's go into the email tool. And you can see really that today it's 
the 18th of December and it really fired off an email. I'm not going to click on the email because my email isn't there, but I can click on the calendar invite, for example, here. And you're going to see that it sent really out a calendar invite for Friday this week and it sent it to my email address. And this really works. Now I have from my website directly locked in a customer call booking an appointment with me. And this is all powered by Make and Vapi. And I can really encourage you, figure this out, test this out. It is an amazing opportunity to automate phone calls and think this further. If you can automate phone calls across your business, locking in customer calls for your team and for your company, the potential is basically endless. And with this, I wish you an amazing automation and see you soon.